Hello everybody, Hyper Mario Sunshine here, and we're back for some more of The Legends of the Breath of the Wild. In the last episode, we made it here to this tower over here. Uh, what's the name of it again? God, I do not know, but remember the name of the tower, wow. Ridgeland Tower, there we go. I guess I was just like a tiny few pixels off. Yes, but last time we helped out this guy, Branley, and we also made it here. We also got, I think, a few uh, more cutscenes done as well, uh, so we could recover our memory. In this episode, we're going to be traveling this way. Also, maybe we might be traveling up here because we do need to unlock this area up here as well. But yeah, we're going to be freeing the Divine Beast uh, heading that way. So there is two more down here, which we're probably going to do later on. I still also want to uncover these places as well. And uh, this last bit up here in the top right. Because uh, we actually were sp actually supposed to go here for the uh, little side quest from uh, from the Hateno Ancient Tech Lab. Because there's another tech lab around here. So, anyways, without further ado, let's head towards... Uh, which Oh, here we go. It should be this way, I believe. Or is it this way? It's definitely towards that giant thundercloud. Yeah, this place is always thunderstorming. So, yeah, that's uh, definitely uh, very worrisome. You know what? We could take a little bit of lightning. Yeah, this place always looks so crazy. Actually, this is, like, probably one place I've never been to often because of how uh, scared I was of this place. So, yeah, Thundra Plateau, and, yeah, this entire place is thundering. You who have reached this land of thunder, I present to you with a trial. I actually did not know that this was a trial area. When the four spirits have been settled in their proper place... They will guide you to the hero's trial. And yeah, it's, it's raining like crazy. Uh, best thing to do... Okay, we have... Do we have any shields? Okay. We need a bow, or is there a bow that's... Okay, we got everything that's wooden. Or non-metal. And holy shit, that's a lot of fucking... Oh, fuck, fuck that. We're going to have to take a little bit of a detour. Damn, they do not want us going there, huh? What the fuck is hurting us? This is very dangerous. Because one lightning bolt could literally just end us right there. Okay, seriously, what the hell? Where are these guys coming from? quite a bit. Alright. Take this one last one out. Alright, so we need to get that thing up there, but the problem is it's really hard to climb up there. Is, is this metallical? No, it's not. Yeah, it's raining. That's the problem. Only if it was easier to climb up there, but... Otherwise, I have no idea. What the hell is this? Oh my god. These things are so annoying. At least there's a purple one in the middle of here. Uh, I'm not sure if they have to go in a specific spot, but... Okay, that one's purple. Red. Green. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. There's a fuck ton of bats. And then that's the other one. Oh, shit. Come on. 
All right, we got the green one next. There's two more. The red, obvious choices being the red one and the other one that we're clearly missing. Yeah, it's gonna strike. Where's the red? Where's the red one? Oh, oh, it's back there. I wonder if it stops like thundering when you uh, finish the trial. Because I've never done this trial before, so I guess everything's so new to me. Again, it's very fucking dangerous to be there. Maybe I, if like I somehow propelled myself with something, uh, we have like a thing to make fire with. Oh, we do, we do. We, we probably have some wood. Uh, wood, 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 wood. Oh no, no, no. We we need to make like a fire, as in like. Uh, like a grounded fire. Okay. Fuck it, just do it like that. Alright. The real situation here is getting this up there. Thing is, one lightning in here could literally just end our life. Or all these fucking dudes over here trying to circle around me. They really are going all out with just trying to mess with you. They can't really attack me there since I'm like literally right next to a wall. Like, what are they gonna do? I right, hope there's another way around this, cause this is not sure. Really, really, I'm not honestly not really sure how to throw this there. Oh wait, hold on. Oh my god, if I had to walk all the way around, that's just such a fucking... Oh my god. Such a weird, stupidly, done, poorly designed thing. Uh... Hello? Can I throw that up there? I guess not. How the hell do I get that up there? Oh my god, please don't tell me. Hold on, I'm gonna drop this. No fucking way! Oh my god, I think I know how to bring that up. <sighs> well, I, I'm saying think, I don't know. But if it is what I think it is, then we just went around in a complete circle for nothing. Oh shit, there's a, there's a fucking thing. Uh, what's it called? Uh, what are those dudes? Fucking Korok. Come here. Mine. Thank you. Yeah. And this guy is, has... This guy... This little guy has a bunch of balls for being here. He's just, you know... freaking wandering around in a place where you can just get struck by lightning. He's got no problem with that. Uh... Alright, we're back. So first, let's do this. Is that gonna make it? Please make it. Oh, thank fucking god. There we go. Oh my god. Ugh. So, I think we have to just bring him to, like, a higher plateau. And also those freaking pieces are stuck up there for some reason. Look at them. They're just flying against the pillar. They're just, like... I don't understand how that's even happening. That's kind of hilarious, honestly. Alright. Throw them there. I guess it won't go in, so we're just going to place it in. Alright, the last one is the red one. Uh, I had to reset, well, load up a, the autosave file, occurred, and just reobtain the red one. I think we're gonna have to aim it from up there. Because that was the highest place we actually originally had it at, so let's go do that. 
Yeah, sorry for the cuts, guys. I just, like... This is just really annoying, and... I want to solve it as quickly as possible. I think one more should do it. Perfect angle for this. All right. Look at oh my! Can I stop them from here? Oh my god! I stopped them from there. That's hilarious. I I stopped an individual one. Uh, we're gonna have to take out the claymore. Actually, not for now. Hold on. Gotta wait this out a bit. Oh, even though that the, our stasis is longer, it will quicker uh, has a lower cooldown. It still takes quite. It still takes. A very long time to, to overcome. Uh, you know, just walk a little closer to it. There's a good spot. All right. That ought to do it. <clears throat> Finally! No more freaking doing this shit. Jesus Christ. Actually start carrying on with the thing. I just wanted to show this off because uh, I always was intrigued by this place, but I never actually did it. The uh, trial here, so... Always something new to experience within every playthrough, whether you're 100%ing or uh, just going through a regular playthrough like I am. Yep. I mean, technically I'm not going through a regular playthrough. I'm trying to go through, like, a uh, com basically the true ending sort of playthrough. Because I guess, like, a regular playthrough would just be, like, you know, being Ganon as quickly as possible. Anyways, I should uproot the shrine that is buried underground. I'm not sure if it's going to be, like, similarly to the ring one that we did uh, a few episodes ago or not, but we'll see. Alright, there we go. Uh, I'm trying to readjust my volume, so if I sound a little bit quiet, please let me know. Uh, I've been trying to adjust, because, like, I've been hearing myself in my some of my uh, earlier Breath of the Wild episodes. I've been sounding a little bit too loud, so I tried uh, rebalancing the volumes, see if I could get the right balance of them. But uh, if, I, if I sound too low now, then I will probably readjust it again just to make it a little bit higher. But uh, yeah. So just let me know about that. Uh, buried secrets. Huh. Oh, okay, I think I know what, this is like a bomb. Uh, you just, like, throw, just throw the bombs around. Yeah, it's a bomb. One. Holy shit, those rocks are just falling apart. Uh, there's a giant button over there. I need something really heavy for that. This honestly seems a little bit pretty fun, honestly. Just blowing shit up. Though, I wonder if we can move one of these things. Or not. <clears throat> supposed to blow up everything in order for like the puzzle to like work or some shit oh yeah we got a metal box hidden in here but it's stuck all right uh 
the hell is that up there? Okay, it's something we could stop time on, but it's not something metallic. Alright, this should probably put the weight down. And it does! There's a chest there. Uh... Oh. That actually might be bad. Oh no, this is not good. Actually, let's see what's up there first. I really, I'm really actually intrigued by that chest. Uh, actually, could we jump from there? Hold on. I think we might actually have room to jump. Yeah, I know. Replay that, I guess. Oh, wait, hold on. I just noticed this. Okay, uh, wasn't far enough, I guess. Alright, we got another chest here, so that's always good. Rubber armor. Oh, so we could become electric resistance. I actually never seen this before. Unless I'm, I legit forgot about this armor from my uh, first playthrough. Uh, but yeah, pretty interesting, nevertheless. <sighs> oh my god, we get up there and then we just fall immediately. Oh, we barely make it. Okay. Let's see if we could try boosting ourselves up here. Alright. Please make it. Please make it. Uh, no! Oh my god. Well, we can't make it. I'm gonna stop right there with that. I'm not sure what's in there. Maybe it's a weapon. Maybe it's something else. Who knows? Anyways, there we have it. Now we're finally going to be off. I wonder if it stops storming, though. It does! Wow! Huh. Alright, well that's pretty interesting. It actually stops raining when you're done. Alright, so I guess we'll be heading off here. We actually could see the, uh... The Divine Beast over there, which is pretty cool. Wow, I'm actually shocked that it stopped storming. So just like this permanent storm cloud, because, uh... The shrine seems to be untouched. Uh, let's head back, actually, to the, uh, tower, because we're, like, in the plateau of sorts, so it's going to be a little bit harder to really do anything. Alright, so we're back up here. Uh, is that what I see up there? It's a tower, yeah. Uh, I think I'll check that off screen, honestly. Although, I wonder where the tower for this one, next 
places. Actually, I think it would be better just to go up there. Huh. Yeah, I think I should have done that to begin with. Should have just headed off there. Well, I think we'll do that in the next episode. So love my videos with that like button. Make sure to subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Next time on The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, we'll finally be heading there. We just want to do that really long quest first, I guess, because i never done it. <laughs>